Hello guys, welcome back to Jimmy Chan in Japan. Thank you so much for tuning in. It has been a long time since I uploaded a video. I do apologize. Uh, as I said, this is just a hobby channel. I have got my full-time job and obviously my family to take care of. So I don't always have a lot of time, but um, if I'm not feeling too tired, I will uh, make a video or two after my job. Uh, the time now is almost 10 in Japan, so it's getting on a little bit, at least for me. So I'm going to make these videos and I'll get them uploaded. Uh, guys, one thing I want to say is thank you so much again for being a subscriber, if you are a subscriber. And if you're not, please subscribe. One of my videos that I uploaded a few weeks ago, which was the Baby Star Ramming, got almost over 100 views, which was, for me, amazing because... Most of my videos have had, what, 25 views at most, so I was really pleased about that. So let's set a challenge, let's try and get as many views as we can on these videos, and also let's try and get those subscriber numbers up. I'm now currently on seven subscribers. I went from nothing for months to having seven, so it means a lot and um, feels like a bit of progress. So anyway, guys, on to the video. So today, uh, as you can see, I've got two items which I found in the supermarket. The supermarket is constantly changing the items, so I'm always finding something of interest. So I hope uh, these two items are of interest to you. Um, the first item we're gonna look at today is this one here. So we'll put the Mario snacks to the side, and we're gonna look at this one here. So the last time I did a video on a uh, Pokemon product was, crikey, uh, must have been last year. And I got quite a lot of views, quite a lot of interest. I had a few people ask me questions. Some people um, gave me some, um, you know, some clues as to who the characters were. Because I'll be honest with you, I'm not a huge fan of, of Pokemon. I've never really got into it. I don't know the characters that well. But I do know in Japan and around the world, Pokemon is very um, popular. So let's look at this item I got. So uh, to be honest with you, I have no idea what this item is, although I do believe it is some kind of biscuit. It's like, I think it's like a wafer biscuit, uh, but it's been dedicated to Pokemon series. Um, so we've obviously got, uh, I know this guy, this is Pikachu and I was going to say Gaku then, but that's Dragon Ball Z. I don't, I, I can't actually remember this guy's name, but he's the one who, who has this Pokemon who befriends him. We've got all the other characters as well. So if you know any of these, or if you know all of them, please put a comment below. I know there's absolutely tons of um, these uh, Pokemons to, to catch. Um, these products are made by a company called Lotte. Lotte are famous for making biscuits. Uh, they also make sweets, snacks, that kind of thing. Um, so yeah, that's the front. Not too... Quite shiny. I like I say, I always love the packaging on these products. They do take a lot of care, the Japanese, with their products. They do know how to sell them. Uh, I've got the ingredients here, and if we pull this back without breaking it, I have no idea what that is. It's question, question. So, yeah, I don't think there's too much to this, to be honest with you. Just the, the Pokemon uh, on the front. But let's get this opened up and... Let's see what it tastes like. So guys, if you're using scissors again, please be careful. I will probably end up giving this snack to my son. He's always asking me like, Daddy, when are you gonna make a video so I can eat the snacks? So tomorrow's his lucky day. So yeah, if you can see that guys, this looks like, let's pull this out. Yeah, it's like a typical wafer. And then you've got, looks like chocolate in the middle. So yeah, nothing, oh, and there is there is actually a sticker inside. So let's have a, I'll tell you what, let's have a look at the sticker because I know you guys can't wait to see what the sticker is. Oh, shiny. Um, wow. Can you, who's this guy? I really need to learn my uh, katakana. I know my hiragana and kanji, but I don't know katakana well yet. So this is obviously a, some, Foreign or, I say foreign, it's the names, it's an English name because they're using katakana. Uh, but yeah, if you guys know who this character is, please put a comment below. It's number three, so there's quite a lot of these to collect by the looks of things. But yeah, nice quality that actually. Um, I don't know what that is on the back. Is that meant to be like 
I don't know, mystery, who is it? And then you turn it over and it's this guy here. So yeah, if you know who this is, please put a comment below. I'll put that to the side with loads of crumbs everywhere. Put it there. And let's get uh, let's get snacking, shall we? Let's try this out and see what it tastes like. I will leave it for my son, so I'm just going to have a bite. Um, it's not bad. I mean, it's the chocolate taste of it cheap. Um, there's nothing really special about it. So I think if you're buying this this item, you're buying it specifically for this, right? Because this is just like your your ordinary wafer with chocolate in. Um, so yeah, you're getting it for the sticker really. So I'm gonna. I, I said to you last time on the videos. I'm gonna start giving all the products that I review uh, a score. So, crunchy, um, cheap chocolate, mm, I'll give this product a four out of 10. Obviously you get the sticker. If you're collecting these, then obviously it's worth buying, but I wouldn't buy this again, uh, particularly. I'm not really into Pokemon. If you guys are, then maybe this is for you. Um, but yeah. Uh, if you know this character, please let me know in the comments below, and um, that would be interesting to know. But yeah, I wouldn't buy this um, just for a snack. I would buy it only if I was collecting these stickers. The actual item cost me uh, was about 100 yen, so about 50 pence a UK, and about a dollar, or just an, less than a dollar US. So it's not too expensive. Um, so yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Here's the wafer. You let me know if you think it looks good. I'm going to give this to my son. And I'm sure he'll enjoy it tomorrow. But guys, thanks very much for tuning in today. I'm going to make another video shortly. And um, let's try and get this video to 100 if we can. Or at least the next video as well. Alright, cheers guys. Have a good one. Bye.